Okay, this is a short little review of uh, some very specialized probes for multimeters. Uh, it's the Pomona 6341. Uh, these probes uh, are super sharp and super small. They're actually meant for probing uh, fine pitch digital assem electronic assemblies, which have really fine pitch, you know, quad flat packs and such. Not um, no matter what kind of meter you buy, even a fairly decent one, you generally just get a generic set of probes, and they actually got quite a large uh, end on them. Now that's not bad if you're trying to probe something, say like an old dip package, and, but those are pretty obsolete. You see a lot and a lot of quad flat packs, really fine pitch, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4.5 millimeter parts. Now basically this kind of probe is completely useless for that. So uh, Pomona does offer this probe set. It's, it's quite expensive. It's actually more expensive than some multimeters. I think I paid about $45 for it. But if you're doing uh, fine pitch electronics designs, um, it's absolutely a, a wonderful to have this because it actually allows you to probe things uh, really closely. Now the probe set's built around actually uh, a, a removable tip. You can pull it out with a pair of uh, pliers, and then they give you a whole new set of other probes that you can use with it. And uh, these pins are very special, actually. They're meant for uh, automatic test equipment. If you're in a manufacturing environment and you need to test a hundredths or millions of boards, it'll basically be a, a piece of equipment called an ATE, and it'll have something called a bed of nails tester off. And what these little pogo pins will do is they'll come up and they'll actually contact the circuit board and do automated tests with it. Um, now, uh, it, what uh, Pomona has done is actually just built a generic set of probes here, which allow you to use these in a uh, in, in a manual probe. Uh, but you get that wonderful fine pitch uh, probability with them, and uh, the probe tips are surprisingly quite easily uh, purchased. Although you can see in this particular kit, I've actually never used them all. They they give you a, a wonderful number of them, so uh, it's uh, really one of those handy things. Let's take a closer look at the probe ends. Okay, what's that? What's well, a crown end, actually? It's uh, used in manufacturing tests, automatic test equipment. If you ever see a circuit board which has a uh, circular land pattern that's been plated, but doesn't seem to have any solder resist, and doesn't seem to have any function, they're often test points for manufacturing purposes, and what will happen is this kind of pin gets installed on an automatic test equipment uh, tester, and it'll actually then uh, probe that point and do some diagnostic tests. Now, uh, this little lead set from Pomona actually allows you to use that particular kind of probe. Along with those, just the standard probes that have the uh, the very sharp uh, chisel point, just get some sense of scale. Uh, here's a, a very traditional probe, and you can see, of course, there's a significant size difference. Now, clearly, these are not meant for um, AC work. These are meant for fine probing of surface mount assemblies. I think the actual package states that they're not better for, than 40 volts, which makes sense. I mean, due to the logic, is all uh, sub 10 volts, of course, uh, these days. Um, it's almost, almost almost sub 1 volt these days. Uh, but anyways, uh, this particular uh, set of leads uh, is, is absolutely uh, wonderful when you're uh, trying to do some debug work on, on a fine pitched assembly. You can uh, you can really probe in there with a lot of confidence. So something that I've definitely found handy, I definitely have upgraded, uh, i got a lead set here in my lab. So when I do uh, work uh, in uh, this domain, um, I find these actually very, very handy. Okay, short little review, but quite frankly, what can you say about a probe set? Uh, other than the fact this one's actually wonderful if you're doing... Uh, Surface mount designs, you've got some fine pitch parts. Um, it's just a wonderful thing to have in your kit.